This fortress was always used by the military and they didn't want to use it anymore and they were searching for a good new purpose for the, for the building. I started brewing when I was 16. I was, I was brewing a lot of different beers in a time that, uh, well, craft beers were not so common in the Netherlands. And, uh, well, I, I did like them. I saw them in other countries and I wanted to make them. And, well, from there on, uh, yeah, beer was always there. Well, I met uh, Daniela, uh, our partners. Uh, didn't know each other and uh, well she heard of the brewing and she said okay I want to learn it too. And in 2009 she suggested to go commercial uh, with it so that was the start and well f from that point we grew bigger and three and a half years ago we got the key of this fortress uh, in our search for a, a bigger place. Yeah. make some beers that can age very well. I think most of the beers are best when drunk fresh, uh, but some type of beers uh, do age very well. For instance, our stout, our winter stout, our smoked double buck. We don't pasteurize our beers. They all, all have re-fermentation and uh, they undergo a very nice changes by time. And well, the conditions of the fortress are also, well, uh, very good for that. We have very dark spaces with a very good temperature year round. I love a good IPA, I love a good triple, uh, but I think other breweries can make that better and we can focus on beers that we understand very well and I think the, 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 the stout type is a kind of beer we understand very well so well we, we like to make that we focus on that and I think we can make uh, the difference there comparing it to, uh, to other breweries. This fortress was built in 1842 uh, and was finished in 1848, something like that. This type of fortress was uh, important to flood the land uh, by w when there was danger. And that was the idea, uh, flooding it with a layer of 60 centimeters of water. Uh, you cannot go by boat on that, you cannot go by horses or cars uh, uh, on that. And that would protect um, the western part, which was economically the most important part of the Netherlands uh, from an invasion and well most of the time that came from the east in, in that day so uh, to protect uh, the, the west from from the east. The Dutch military used it the last 30 years for the research on, on, on bombs and explosives and also to what they found to, to uh, let it explode on their controlled conditions. We thought it's perfect because it was a very nice location, um, good conditions for the beer, uh, for the, the aging uh, of the beer, uh, and also the water system is quite unique. Uh, all the fortresses have a water system that's filtering rainwater, and in times of war they uh, well, they must survive some time with, with the water they had on the fortresses. I think it can add a twist we like uh, in our beers. Not overwhelming, but just the good accent uh, um, by using this water. Uh, in the tower we have four kinds of uh, bats uh, that are living there and they stay there in winter time and also some unique plants uh, over the place um, that are very well protected so uh, yeah but we knew that uh, when we started and uh, i think it makes it also unique 15 years ago i if you would have asked me i could not imagine that i would be 
owner of a brewery and, and not working in, in healthcare, but making beer in a unique place. That was, yeah, I, I could not have imagined that.